Go. Hi, boys and girls and everybody out there in Discover Country. It's me, the Big Blue Rabbit, here with another episode of Discover Time from the West Side Library. And I have my co-host with me today, Miss Judy. Hi, boys and girls. Just kidding around. Since we're doing the color blue, I thought I'd bring the big blue rabbit in just for fun. We'll put him aside there. Well, we have quite a bit to do today, so I'm just going to jump right in. Let me get the discover sign and put that aside. Okay, today our story is Small Bunny's Blue Blanket. I like the color blue. It's a very peaceful kind of color. Small Bunny loved blue blankets. Everything he did, Small Bunny did with blue blankets. Small Bunny needed blue blankets to help him go even higher on the swings. He needed blue blanket to help him paint his best pictures and he needed blue blanket to help him read the hardest words in his book. Small Bunny and Blue Blanket were always together. One day when they were in the sandbox, Mommy called, Time to come in, Small Bunny. You both need a bath. I'll bet your mother says that to you sometimes. Small Bunny thought Blue Blanket was perfect the way it was. Maybe kind of smelly and dirty, but he liked him. His mommy did not agree. Bunny! Look at, they're hiding under the bed. After Small Bunny was washed and dry, Mommy picked up Blue Blanket and put it in the washing machine. Don't worry, she said. It will only take a minute. It actually took 107 minutes. And Small Bunny washed Blue Blanket for every single one. Mommy hung Blue Blanket out to dry. Good as new, she said. Small Bunny did not agree. He did not like new. Uh-oh, he looks angry. But after plenty of swinging, painting, reading and playing. Blue Blanket was just the way it was before. Perfect. Yes. So that was Small Bunny's Blue Blanket and it was written by Tatiana Feeney. There we go. All right, let's do our calendar. We're in the month of August still. August 2020. Let's say our days of the week together. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And today is Tuesday, the 11th of August. Let's look at this calendar. 
We are in August. We said that is the last month of summer, the last full month of summer. And as always, Discover is on Tuesday. We are still in the summer season. It's hot out there today. I'll tell you, it's hard to get in the car when it's hot. And today was bright and sunny. We did have some rain last week, which was very, very welcome. All right. Our color for August is blue. And I already showed you the blue bunny. Our shape for August is the pentagon. The pentagon has five sides. One, two, three, four, five. Five. But this month, our number is nine. Nine. And I found a little poem to help us remember number nine. Here's a number nine here. Around the head and down the spine. That's how you make the number nine. Nine little monkeys swinging on a vine. Nine little monkeys are very fine. You think there's nine monkeys here? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine monkeys. All right, how about our letters for this month? X. X-ray. Extra. Y. Y. Yes. Yak. Yesterday. V. Zipper. Zebra. And our sight words. Fast. Can you run fast? Look. Look up at the sky. Walk. Walk to school. And up. Up. The ceiling is up. You can make a sentence. Look up. Up. And here's another sentence. Walk fast. Walk fast. Pretty good. You guys are learning a lot of words. Our poem for October is the Teddy Bear's Picnic. Let's say it together if you can. All right. If you go down in the woods today, you're sure of a big surprise. If you go down in the woods today, you'd better go in disguise. For every bear that ever there was will gather there for certain because today is the day the teddy bears have their picnic. Picnic time for teddy bears. The little teddy bears are having a lovely time today. Watch them, catch them unawares, and see them picnic on their holiday. See them gaily gad about. They love to play and shout. They never have any cares. At six o'clock, their mommies and daddies will take them home to bed because they're tired little teddy bears. And there's some little teddy bears. Speaking of teddy bears, and the number nine, and the color blue, can you see this? I have nine blue bears. I have bigger ones, and middle-sized ones, and tiny ones. 
see if we can count them together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three big bears plus three middle-sized bears plus three tiny bears makes nine bears all together. I like those counting bears, they're fun. Now, just a couple of items of things I need to tell you about. Our summer program is over this week, so there's a couple things we need you to do. Uh, we need you to come into the library, or your parents or grandparents can come, either way, because we still can't let little kids in the library yet. Um, because of the coronavirus. But we want you to get one of these, uh, it's a backyard scavenger hunt paper. And we would like you to look and see how many of these items you can find. You don't have to collect them. All you need is like a crayon. And when you find one of these items, you just color in the little picture. They want you to find an acorn, some dirt, a squirrel, the sun, if you can see the sun, a bee, a tree, a bird, a leaf, a worm, a twig, a cloud, a flower, water, grass, and feather. So let's say since our number, August is the number nine, if you can find nine of these items, you're doing all right. So have your mom or your grandparents or somebody stop by and Pick one of these up. It's, it's a lot of fun. And also, if you uh, did crafts or got books from the library or watched any of our videos, either Michael's comic book videos or Miss Judy's Discover videos, you can get a prize and a book. Um, we have lots of books to choose from, and we've got some prizes. Just as a sample, I'll show you. We've got this nice hardcover book called Dude. This is a real popular one. We've only got a couple copies left. so. But we have a lot of other books, a lot, lots to choose from. If Dude's not your thing, we've got plenty of others. And also, we still have a pretty good selection of stuffed animals to choose from. We have these uh, sharks. Um, we've got a green dinosaur and like a red dinosaur and a little pink, I don't know what she is, a cat or something. So, you know, say mom, dad, grandma, grandpa, please, can we go out to the library and get my book and my stuffed animal for the summer reading program? Well, that's all I have for today. I'm... I'm really sorry that we couldn't get together this summer because we had a lot of good stuff planned, but maybe soon. So remember to keep washing your hands and obey your moms and dads and grandparents and wear your mask if you need to. And um, I'll see you back here next week. You have a great week. Bye.